Hey guys, <laughs> what's up? I don't really know how to start this video. You haven't seen me on this vlog channel in a while. Um, I don't know how to start this video. I feel really awkward. Yeah, I haven't posted on my vlog channel or my main channel in about a month. Um, and I wanted to post this quick little video kind of explaining why, where I've been, what I'm planning, and what you can expect to see from me. Um, so I guess I'll just start. Sorry that I feel really awkward and uncomfortable. It's because I am. Um, so unless you follow me on Instagram or on Twitter, um, you might not know that 35 days ago when I was on the plane to Mexico for my 30th birthday trip, that I've been planning for a long, long time. Um, I received news that my dad had unexpectedly passed away. And I, I don't really think that I'm ready to talk about it on camera. And I'm, I'm, it's so fresh. It's so new. I'm, I've never felt this kind of grief and loss before where it like has been taking over my life and my thoughts and my ability to get back to my job. Um, I wish so badly sometimes, just in this moment, that I had a regular job where I could just distract myself, but my job, I, I pride myself and my brand about being honest and authentic, and I always find it so beautiful when other creators share in their most vulnerable, sad, happy moments, and I've always tried to do that with everything that I do. Um, I'm just trying to take a step back right now in terms of... I want to deal with these emotions with my family and with the people and with, with my loved ones in my real everyday life first before I just kind of broadcast it on the internet. There is a very, very fine line. I don't want to act out of crazy, irrational grief. Because um, I know that, and if you've experienced grief like this, like people are known to act out and be spontaneous and make rash decisions. So I'm really trying to... To, to continue my vlog channel, take a step back and get some time for me because I do think that there will be a point when I wanna talk about it. That's just not today, that's just not right now. Um, but with that said, I feel like you guys know me, you guys have been following me for a while and if you're new here, this would be a very strange video for you to watch for the first time. Hi, if you are. Um, but I deal with my emotions by talking about them. So chances are in this vlog channel, there will be little moments that will trigger me to want to talk about it or mention it. And uh, to be totally honest, I'm really nervous to like continue my vlog channel like this with, with all of these things going on in my head. It's very easy to tell. I feel like when I'm editing, it's very easy to tell when I'm uncomfortable or when I'm I don't want to talk about a top. I don't know. There's there's not many things that I don't want to talk about in life with my vlog channel online. It's just I'm not quite ready to talk about it all at once on a big crying video about my life. Like I'm just not ready to do that. And right now I just want to take care of my family and talk to them about it. So yeah. Um, with all of that said, before this happened, um, obviously I did not go to Mexico. I I had to get a new flight back to Denver. Um, before that, I already had two vlogs edited by my amazing editor ready to go, and those were supposed to go live, and they haven't, and I'm sitting on them. I have these two vlogs that are so happy, and I thought about not posting them because they're from, they're from a month ago, which I guess I've been known to do if you're new to this channel. Um, but like, I guess I wrote something down that are the reasons why I, I want to post them still. Yeah, so I'll read that now. Um, I started, when I was editing, I wrote this down. I need something to like fidget with. My hands are like, you know, I'm like that. Um, I wrote, it feels weird to watch these old vlogs. I watch myself and I'm so happy. I'm so joyful and full of life and nothing devastating has happened to me at that moment. I'm planning for Mexico and talking about how productive I'm feeling and it's just sad to look at myself from where I sit now. I feel damaged and crumpled up now trying to slowly get back to where I was. And that was my first initial just writing my thoughts down when I first started to like dip my toe back into editing and, and the YouTube world and, it, and it's been a weird feeling, I don't know, overall. 
Um, and so I wrote, this was such a happy day. The reason I didn't want to scrap these videos is because there's a lot of stuff that I talk about in these vlogs, these two vlogs, that's relevant to what I'm up to now, like my journey to start streaming on Twitch, some things I bought for the house and other things like that. And then I ended my little journal notes to myself by saying, seeing myself a month ago gives me hope that I can one day get back to that kind of happiness and carefreeness. And I mean, all of that sounds like really emo and I don't know, it's just like my initial thoughts that just popped in when I was editing it for the first time. Um, if you haven't experienced grief, every day is different. Some days I'm great, some days I'm not. Some days will start great and then they end terribly or they'll start terribly and they end great. It's just, I'm a little all over the place right now if I wasn't already all over the place before this. And I just really appreciate you guys giving me the space to step back. I appreciate my Patreon. Holy crap, I appreciate you guys so much. I have been trying to find the words to talk to you guys. The amazing humans in my Patreon, the month of May was not a regular month of May in the Lauren Lippman Patreon community and everyone has just been amazing. I was expecting hundreds of people to just drop because they weren't getting the content that I promised them and I don't think anyone did. And I can't explain what that means to me I really don't even have the words. Honestly, I'm just trying to figure out a way to get back to my life and my job while also dealing with these feelings with the therapist, with my parent, with my mom and my brother. And it's there's just a lot happening. There's so much happening right now. And I wanna end this little mini video on a happy note. Huh, so my original plan for my 30th birthday was gonna be me, Matt, my friend Kelsey and Alona from Denver. So that first trip didn't happen and I am honestly so excited to tell you guys. I know it seems like I'm not excited but it's just because talking about this stuff just like brings me down. And so that's that's really what I'm trying to say is like I need a little space to deal with this myself. I I'm just trying to get back to my life right now. But um, in the sense of that, I am very excited to announce that Matt my boyfriend and I are headed to Mexico tomorrow for a makeup 30th birthday trip for me to actually celebrate my 30th birthday at a new resort. It's a lot nicer than our first one. I'm so excited. I will be vlogging there. And I'm excited to tell you guys this because I feel like it's been, it's been weird to get back to vlogging. And I'm excited to do that in such a beautiful, beautiful place. This resort we're going to is so stunning. I don't want to like jinx it until we're there. So... Yeah, my vlog channel's coming back. I have two vlogs from a month ago that are gonna go up today, Tuesday, May 25th, and tomorrow, Wednesday, May 26th. I just wanna get them up and out there. They're really, they're really happy days. It's, it's nice. I enjoyed them. I enjoyed watching and editing the vlog that I made a month ago, so I think you guys will too. And that's, yeah, that's really what I wanted to come on here and say. Um, I don't really know how else to end this except that I just appreciate you guys. Some of you guys donated to the GoFundMe that we rate that for my mom and the funeral costs. I just thank you so much. I've never known loss like this and I've never known love like this and support like this from people because I've never needed it this bad. So just thank you. If you wrote me a card to my P.O. box, if you went in my DMs, if you commented on my Instagram post, on my Twitter, just thank you, I see you, I haven't had a chance to respond to everybody. It, it, it really filled my heart with so much love when I needed it the most last month and today and every day and just, yeah. Attempting to get back to my life. I'm a little changed right now, a little, Da I don't know, I keep, Matt keeps being like, don't call yourself damaged, you're not damaged. But I'm like, sometimes I just feel like, like a regular task is harder for me. Like I'll just find myself just like holding makeup, just like looking somewhere and just being like, what am I doing again? Like it's, it's, it's been really tough. And you know, with YouTube, with working for yourself, you don't get to take PTO days. So trying to work through it and trying to work through it in the public eye online is very strange but I have faith I can do it. And I just, I love my audience here. You guys are like my little vlog channel friends. So thank you. Um, two vlogs going up today after this video and then tomorrow and then I will be vlogging all throughout Mexico. Make sure you're following me on Instagram because I will be posting daily on there. 
Yeah, so there's a lot of bittersweetness in this little video message. And I don't even think my video, the vlog that you're about to see today, is gonna be monetized because I play a Taylor Swift song in it. Go figure. But I still think it's a really fun day anyway. So please enjoy. Thank you for watching this little video and for being so nice to me and giving me the space I need. I love you all so much. I feel very lucky to do what I do. And hopefully you guys can give me some advice if you've been in my shoes because I need all the advice that I can get. I'm in therapy. I'm doing yoga again. Just trying to, trying to get back to it. Anyways, I'm rambling. Thank you so much for watching. See you in tom today's vlog, tomorrow's vlog, and all over my Instagram for the next week in Mexico. And I can't wait to show you those vlogs. Thank you guys so much for literally everything. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Mwah. See you soon. Bye.